Hi, good morning everybody. Today is May 2023, Memorial Day weekend, Monday morning at 6 o'clock. I just did a video prior on the sunset for Loop J. Now I'm gonna walk down the staircase from Loop J campsite down to the RV section and show you that loop. Okay, so right now you'll see that this is the Atlantic Ocean. Nice and beautiful. Not much waves, very quiet. And the sunset, look at that. I mean, not sunset, this is the sunrise. Wow, amazing. Look how circle it is. Look how yellow it is on the... Let me take a picture of this. All right, now we're gonna head down. Oof, gotta be careful on these steps. They are very, very uh, steep. Wow. Oof. And if you prefer not to go down the stairs, you can always try to walk down the hill on the grass. Because it's very challenging. Especially if you're older. These steps are not good for your knees. <laughs> so now you see that this is the section for the RVs. Let me start off with this building over here. So this is the building for bathrooms and showers. Hot showers in there with the bathroom. And then over here is the section for the RV stays. So over here we have site H15 here. Next one, this one is age 14. Over here is one of the staff members that lives here. You see, he has a nice garden in the front, RV, his own driveway. Got dumbbells for workouts. And I think there used to be a satellite dish over here, but I don't know where he went. There was. Yeah. Over here with site H13. And numbers will get smaller and smaller. There'll be H12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. This charge over here. It's H12. Oh, there's no one here. It's empty site here. H11. Lots of uh, big RVs here with their own power. It's a nice, uh, nice setup over here. Got its own picnic table, own sneak screen. And then over here, it's nice. Look how many bikes they, they brought over here on the back of the We're RV. Gonna back. We're gonna walk down to the flag and then come back.
Yeah. We should get a, a big nice RV at the back. See, this one has been staying here for a while. So they, they put the thing underneath the wheels. So it doesn't move. And they have two bikes over there. And plus the, the pickup truck. Why is this one here for a while? Well, because they set it up like that, or else they would have, they wouldn't be setting it up on the platform. See, so this is site H nine. They're all smaller sites across, which is site AI over here. So these are smaller sites. These, these are smaller sites. So the I's are on the right side. The H are in the middle loop area. Right now, we're, where the flag is, we're heading towards the main office. Wow, look, this, they're having a party over here. Look how many people there are here. So this is I-8. And then the one with the passport RV is I-7. Pretty big area for this one. Oh, there's another empty site here. Oh, look, there's a little baby teepee. We should get like one of these screens over here to prevent like bugs from coming in like when we're eating. Because like, yeah, during like the summertime, there's gonna be a lot of bugs. So the site is I-16. Oh, stay to the side, there's a car coming. Okay, come to the side, come to the side. Hey, didn't they used to be like a big mud puddle? Yeah, they used to be. So there's a Tesla over here. Oh, this guy's leaving. Oh wait, there's another one. Wait, what? That has to like, pull that trailer. Yeah. Oh, let me take a look first. Wow, they're all leaving over here. Early in the morning. I guess they're going back home. Wow, and he has two RVs in the back. Well, say bye. Let me see. Wow, they left early. It's only 6 o'clock. Now, let's see. So yeah, they can be able to sleep in there like yeah. it's portable so they can So could a Tesla pull an RV? That's a good question. Well it does have indoors total capacity. Really? The Tesla model X can pull a commercial jet. What, what, what model is this car? That's the Model Y. Model Y? Wow that's but this RV campsite is so modern looking. Look how like both sides pops up. You see how it's like 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 it's plastic in the middle and both sides pop up to give more space so I think they're just towing like a little like a small piece it's not like a big RV that they're towing wow here's a nice uh, old Benz very classic 300D turbo diesel yeah the 300D turbo diesel that's a pretty nice car and then there's an Odyssey over there Oh yeah, the Odyssey. Typical uh... I hate Odyssey. Oh no, 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 no. So we're back at uh, H4 over here. And then on the other side is I... Uh, what, what is this? I4? So we're doing a video of loop to H well, and I. I. Oh, it's I14. Okay. So the numbers are getting bigger for I's. Numbers are getting smaller for on this side of H. Yeah. How can that Nissan pull that big RV? Yeah, sometimes it's very impressive that these cars can pull such a big RV, right? That Nissan can pull this. Holy moly. I'll be impressed if the Tesla could pull something like this. Wow, this is 
this is a nice setup. Like the Model X can tow an entire commercial jet. Yeah. Oh, here's a pathway that goes to the picnic area. I-12? Yeah, that's I-12. And we just passed H3. Oh, okay. And H2. This is H1, right here. And then, this is not, oh this guy has his own solar panel <laughs> to power his RV. Oh, and a surfboard. Wow. That's pretty cool. I thought surfing was prohibited here. Oh, um, maybe, maybe not. So over here, where the flag is, is the main entrance. That building to the right, that's the office where everyone, oh wait, the building to the right over here, behind this, is where everyone checks in. And this is the main beach area too. Bathroom, seafood, you see a little playground at the back. Right at the back, right there, that's the playground. So if you don't go camping and just want to go to the beach, you have to uh, pay to come in here, park your car, and then you have you can go to the beach for a day. The beach, the public beach access, well not public, but you still have to pay for it, but the regular access. It's where the camps, where the playgrounds Did is over there. you have to pay to paint Yeah, you have to pay. And over here, now we're just gonna finish this loop. And over here, look, it says Camp G, H, and I. H is in the middle. I was on this side. So and there's G is probably on, on the other side. But it says only registered campers permitted in cramp grounds. Okay, now we're just gonna walk. Let's go past beyond these dunes. So that was loop H. And this is loop G now. This side is called loop G. This is G1. Should that be called loop G, H and I? G, H, and I. So this is all I. I mean, this is all G's on this side. H is the one that we did, and I is the further one that's closer to the trees. And this video is not going to be too, too good because we're riding, heading, we're heading towards the sun. So I think what I'll do is that I will. Let's go, let's go to, uh, do you want to go up here? Let's go up to the sand dunes. You want to go up and take a look? Or you're going to get sand in your shoes. So the, so the best part of, uh, you know. So you don't have holes like clocks, I just got to be careful. Oh, okay. So the best part of staying at this campsite is the quick access to the uh, beach. Now I'm just walking up the sand dunes, passing by nice flowers, and uh, onto the beach site. So this is the beach. Now there were no lifeguards yesterday, but I think swimming is going to start today with lifeguards. So there's already someone over there swimming. Early in the morning. Wow, look at that. Look at this view of the Atlantic Ocean. The f most eastern part of New York. And the crazy waves. Wow, a nice blue sky. There's someone swimming there. And there are people fishing on this side. Wow, look at that. Morning sunrise. And you'll see that it's pretty steep over here. Once they're Later in the day, the water will come up more.
right so if you like this video please like subscribe and share uh, I hope this was a very informative section I mean video for campsite section I H and G the RV section and in my prior video I made a loop I mean I made a I made a video of loop J and um, now I'm gonna end this video. Uh, see ya.